Oh, what do we like to be beside the seaside? Part 1 We have long taken it for granted that a lung full of sea air and getting sand between our toes is good for our well-being. But does being by the seaside really make a difference to health? The Victorian school is thought so. Building beach huts and promenades as beautiful location along the UK coastline. But even the latest census data reveals that people living that people living near the sea are happier than those inland. So what's going on? A new study at the University of Exeter is trying to find out and if we can harness the benefits for people living miles from the sea. We know that city living can really affect our mental health and well-being and undermine it but also our physical health, particularly through the release of stress hormones and exercising less, says Dr. Matthew White, who is leading the project. What we are really interested in doing is reconnecting people with the natural environment to try and reduce that stress. A natural mood enhancer. The problem with studying the natural world is that it is highly complex, making teasing out the relevant factor from a seaside scene particularly tricky. To solve this, Scientists have tried to recreate specific parts of the coastal environment in the lab. That's how volunteer Joe comes to be in small, windowless room with only an exercise bike and a video of the beach for company. She is taking part in an experiment at the European Center of Environment and Human Health, looking at the mental and physical health effects of the blue or watery environment. A.B. Scott from the University of Exeter Medical School is one of the project's researchers. We want to see if we can increase someone's mood and get them exercising for longer if they are cycling in a natural environment, she told the BBC. The current study is already building on the promising past research. One study found that people's mood increased more when they were shown in a blue environment compared to green, urban or blank hole. A second study discovered that if you ask people to cycle on an exercise bike for as long as they want, those with the lowest mood and self-esteem cycled for a much shorter time than happier volunteers. The new study combines the two asking whether people with a low mood will feel happier from the blue environment and as consequences cycle for longer. This will reveal whether being in a blue seaside environment can turn people's low mood around and encourage them to be physically fitter in the process.